speed frequency of moving horns. While sitting in your car by the side of a country, country road, you are approached by your friend who happens to be in an identical car. You blow your car's horn, which has a frequency of 260 hertz. Your friend blows his car's horn, which is identical to yours, and you hear a beat frequency of 6 hertz. How fast is your friend approaching you? So, since we are sitting in a car that is at rest on the side and of a country road, we have a observer, stationary observer, but the source is approaching. So, the source is approaching observer. The source is approaching the observer. The detected frequency by the observer will be higher than the actual frequency of sound generated by the source. By an amount, propagation speed of sound V divided by V minus V source as we have shown in the lecture and it will also have a detected wavelength that is lambda minus uh, the source speed multiplied by the period. Now we hear a beat frequency, which is the difference between the detected frequency and the actual frequency. So F prime minus 260 is 6. Therefore, the frequency detected by the observer is 266 hertz. So F prime divided by F is V divided by v minus v source so this tells us that v minus v source is uh, f over f prime multiplied with f so this tells us that v source is 1 minus f over f prime uh, multiplied with v or we can write this as f prime minus f divided by f multiplied with v so that's the uh, speed of the source so if we can write this as speed of the source is equal to the beat frequency delta f divided by uh, f prime f prime minus uh, f over uh, f prime is what we have here f prime minus f over f prime so delta f over f prime multiplied by the propagation speed of uh, sound so this is how we calculate the speed of the source and the speed of the source if we plug in the numbers here is 6 hertz beat frequency divided by the detected frequency 266 multiplied by 343 meters per second speed of sound in air so we find the speed of the source to be 7.74 meters per second approaching the observer so uh, we have taken the speed of sound to be 343 meters per second in air at 20 degrees Celsius. All right, so uh, while sitting in our car by the side of a country road, that means we are at rest, we are approached by a friend in an identical car, produces sound with the same frequency, 260 hertz with us, but we hear a beating of six hertz. How fast is the friend approaching you? When the source is approaching the observer, the detected frequency is higher than the actual frequency, by a factor v over v minus vs so vs is the speed of the source and the wavelength is decreased lambda minus vs times t so frequency increases wavelength decreases now the beat frequency is the difference between the two frequencies detected frequency and the uh, actual frequency so f prime minus f because we have two uh, sounds interfering here the sound generated by us and the sound detected by us due to the uh, source so this gives us 
detected frequency 266 hertz which is indeed higher than the actual frequency generated by our friend and using this Doppler shift uh, relationship we can find the speed of sound to be beat frequency divided by detected frequency f prime times v so if we substitute the numbers the final answer is 7.74 meters per second